Hey, good morning, Turtle Club. It is just a minute or so before the 8 a.m. hour on this wonderful Saturday morning, which is the buffet. And it's time for our morning Gora coffee, guys. We're going to do some fishing today, so it's not going to be the most entertaining stream as far as what you're seeing on the screen at times, except for this guy right here, I hope. Maybe I make you laugh, maybe make you cry, maybe uh, it's really bad that you want to splatoon this early in the morning. Hey, Catwater. Kristen Sr., hello. Kuin, hey. Dylan Blackbird, Sabo, good to see you, sir. Oh, good to see you. Absolutely, Dylan. Absolutely, man. And uh, looks like... The one named Top Wrecked Roblox was here about 20 minutes early. Hey, Lucas, how's it going? Hobbs, Matt Rayford. Oh, man, we got a lot of people coming in this morning, which is super awesome. Guys, um, today is a buffet stream, which means at 9 o'clock we take the number of subs we gain. We take the number of likes we get. And we take the number of people watching. We add them all together, and that's how much longer we go past 9 o'clock. Oh, Victoria! Well, no problem at all there. Hey, Fox T. How's it going, ma'am? Holidays are... Yeah, it is the weekend. It is the weekend, guys. Freddy, how's it going? All right. So if you guys remember yesterday, Mario Kart was fun, Lucas. Oh, yes. It was blast, man. Lucas was there playing Mario Kart Melee or Free For All with us last night. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Uh, we, uh, we wound up coming across one of our fans, Vulcan Me. Vulcan's really good. Hey, Mufasa, Mufasa. Good morning to you. So we're just going to hop right back into hunting down the fish. Uh, Jelly King. Uh, yes, yes, the name does sound familiar. Hey, Drew. Awesome. It's it's a nice Saturday. Yeah, Efren Garcia, how are you today as well? Looks like somebody set fire to like the ground over here. Maybe I can get up here. Had this game on GameCube ages ago. I'm playing this on the Wii U. It is the HD version. So there's a couple changes that the GameCube version has compared to this. The one that everybody and their their uh, their best friend keeps telling me about is the fact that there's this Swift Cell, which we finally got. Okay. Huh. Probably yet another... Island that I can't beat yet. Hey, Blah2005, glad to see you, sir. Oh, it's another Korok. Hi, Korok, how you doing? Hmm. So we need more force water at some point. You haven't watched me in months. Uh, Jelly King, it, I don't know if it's been months, man, but it's uh, it's been a little bit. This looks like some sort of butterfly. That's probably a joy pendant based thing. Okay. Hmm. And what's this sign say? Southern Ferry Island, head east from here, it says. Well, now. Okay. Well, nothing really going on here that we can probably deal with. Um. Well, then again, we could probably blow this rock up. Oops, wrong button. 34 days early birthday. Well, happy early birthday, Freddy. Did we blow the rock up? Well, we didn't. Oh, all four switches on this island, you must activate them all swiftly. Oh. So there's four switches. And if we activate... All four of them on swiftly. It's not going to be good. I'm missing the item I need for the button. Yeah, I, I think I'm going to leave these buttons alone. How does Shipwreck Sunday work? Hey, Lucas. That's a good question, sir. If you notice, the total amount of donations we have right now for our P.O. box that we're trying to get is 2401. That last digit is a 1, and that's the important thing. And that's another switch. Wow, so we have, like, that kind of a switch, that kind of a switch... And those two other switches. Okay, so we don't know how to do two of these switches. We're going to go. But that last digit determines where we land up. And Pizza Ball and I were discussing it. And we th we think it might be easier and better off. Uh, two or one months, you say. All right, you'll check. Uh, but we, uh, we're thinking we're probably going to make it to where at the end of the Saturday stream. Because it's just easier to like kind of 
hold on to that. So right now it's Mario Rabbids. Uh, if you'll notice, as the the title over there is scrolling, the digit tells you what it is. Hey, Koala Beast, how's it going? Uh, we got us another fish, guys. We're about halfway through all of them. We already we already got this fish. Uh. Okay. Uh if it's multiplayer, Lucas, then we'll probably do a voice chat for it. How will I account for exchange rates, Matt? Um, it's going to be USD. That's just the best way I can do it, man. Um, it actually, exchange rates through Streamlabs and Google already kind of puts it in there. Hey, Lucario Hunter, how's it going? All right, well, it would really... Oh, I'm already... It's already got my bow equipped. Or not. Okay. This is not going good at all, guys. Hey, we got one in them. Man, that one didn't get it all. Mario Rabbit is great. You've been watching your boyfriend play? That's cool to guy. I've I've played just the little tutorial mode. And I think I actually finally got the way to hit this guy. Like right toward the edge of the water might be good. There we go. Ha. Huh. All right, that's cool. Man versus fish. Yeah, there you go. There you go, Kristen. Ah, uh, what's the deal, Fry? We only hit you five times. That was kind of neat. That's a good way to break up the kind of the fishing monotony, I guess. Um, I wonder if all the fish do that when you go through and just kind of open them up. Similar to the acorn koroks. Yeah, very similar to the acorn koroks. Yeah, if it's multiplayer, I'd do voice chat because the multiplayer games, I you know, I feel like part of what makes it so good is the voice chat. Um, I don't know about, like, the multi single player and all that kind of stuff. Hey, Dylan, all right, we'll be here, man. No worries, dude. Somewhere around here, there's a fish. And we're going to feed. I see him out there. Wow, he's jumping up pretty good. I thought we fed this fish. I guess not. Go small fry. Charting information about the island. That's exactly what we're going for. And then after we get this, we're down to, the, I think, one piece of bait. I know I've heard this little factoid. Huh. Oh, maybe a different way of saying it. Hey, Stephen Thompson, I'm glad you can stay for once. 
Iron Dragon, an out of print board game, is available once again. Oh, that's cool, though, guy. Hey, Lou, how's it going? All right, so... I bet that's all... Yep, that's Mikey being a day late and a dollar short on telling everybody that the stream started. It's, let's go get Beatles chart open. See if we got any Beatles nearby. Ah, not too close. We got one to the south of us. We'll probably go track him down for some bait. Boy, the further you get on this map, the closer to the edges you get, just the more foreboding it gets, right? I mean, if is I. Is that something that, like, I'm imagining, or is it is that true, guys? I mean, are you seeing it, too? Because these storms just seem to only come when I get to this little area of the world. It's like the fish know I feed them now. They've all been uh, domesticated. Uh, due to work, you can only watch on Saturdays and Sundays and sometimes Fridays. Well, that's all right, Luke. Uh, that's Due to work, that's the reason why I can only stream this times that I stream. So I totally understand that, man. Totally understand that. All right, and what's over here? Does it... Wait, what? Hmm. Okay, that's odd. Storms can sometimes signify a giant squid is nearby. Oh! Well, if there's a giant squid, we definitely don't want to be messing with those things. Hope this gets lots of views so you can come back and have the stream still going. Well, me too, man. But it is what it is. Hey, Sally! Okay, totally understand. No worries. Make sure you like the video, and that'll make sure everybody else can watch a little bit longer today. And for those of you joining, my name is Mag Synchro. I'm with Convertible Turtle Gaming. That's myself and my wife, Digrat, who make up the channel. I stream every morning at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, real life permitting. Uh, speaking of real life, this Monday I got to go back and do battle with the dreaded dentist. It's one of two remaining battles, and that'll be this Monday and next Monday, and then I'll be done with the dentist for this whole year. So hopefully we'll not have that kind of problem anymore. Um... In August 24, 2017, that's the last time you watched. Oh, wow, Jelly King. So it's been, it's uh, almost been a full month. So you're about a day off. But yeah, man. All right, do I have any bait? I'm out of bait. I got to get the beetle. I really got to get the beetle. Here, beetle, 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 beetle. Yep, thanks, Hewan. It, it's, uh, it's not going to be that bad of an appointment. It's a follow-up to the original appointment so they're basically going to be checking my teeth seeing how well the uh, procedures have taken all that and then the Monday after is when they're doing the final procedure for the uh, for the actual bridge that I got put in I wonder if there's anything I can do on this island now that I've got all these new toys possibly not Hey, Chadley, how's it going, man? Chadley come in and skunked us for a bit, too, on Mario Kart last night. And those of you that aren't familiar with Chadley, he does a family-friendly stream with him and the Duck Squad. That's his wife and kids. They're pretty awesome at what they do. Play a variety of things from Mega Man Maker all the way over to Roller Coaster Tycoon. Uh, he's doing the Half-Life 2 playthrough. Uh, getting braces, Lou. Oh, wow. Wow. We need to hit 24 likes? Oh, Kristen. Uh, that's that's a pretty good goal. Uh, yesterday, we got a combined total of 61 between viewers, likes, and new subs. And so, uh, if we get past that, that'd be awesome. Yeah, Mega Man Maker. He does a lot of that. It's pretty good. Hey, Panda Love, how's it going? I don't know if I can get to 30 points while I'm working with this guy here. I don't know if I have enough inventory space for it even. Bye. 
Let's see here. Hit items. I got like two more slots in my bait bag, so I'll buy two more slots worth. You don't care how someone. Don't... Yeah, Mega Man's really fun, man. Mega Man's really fun. I, uh, when they had the Anniversary Collection Edition come out, I bought it for GameCube forever ago. It's one of those games, though, that I played and kind of got bored with it. Uh, gotta get your wisdom teeth pulled and a broken tooth in a few weeks. 28 with wisdom teeth. Uh, Drew, I'm 36 with wisdom teeth, and next year I gotta get all four of mine extracted as well. I, I'm not looking forward to that at all. Well, wait a second. Oh, okay. Bye. Apparently I can't carry more than... Well, why can't I put another slot there? It would look like I can. I guess I can only hold nine... Eight things in the little bait bag. Okay. Hi, Emma Bema. Glad to see you. But yeah, I got to get all four wisdom teeth pulled. But that'll be next year, guys. And hopefully there'll be some better scheduling with all this. Because I know it's coming up next year. And it's not one of those things like, you know, I what happened this year is I broke my tooth eating a carrot. And uh, carrots are great. I love carrots. I, I hate the fact that I broke my tooth eating one. But uh, it's one of those things like I, I don't plan to have any kind of, you know, mishaps again. All right, we'll be here, Chris. No worries. You really wanted all the shrines in Breath of the Wild to be all linked together like the dungeons? And Mega Man Legends? You know, that'd be kind of cool. Um, there's, there's a lot of things that Nintendo could have done with the shrine dungeons, but they just they just missed the boat on a lot of things in my opinion. Oh that was not good. Well fine, if you don't wanna part of the solution, just be part of the problem here, Mr. Fish. Or not. Um, okay, take evasive action. Uh, that'll work. That'll work. You missed dungeons in Breath of the Wild? I, you know, I kind of did and kind of didn't. I mean, I, I like the fact that it gave you kind of a mini dungeon-esque kind of thing going on. Oh, there's the fish. All right. Hello, fish. We saw you jump up out of the water. We're going after you. I wonder what the actual terrain distance draw for this on GameCube was. Because I'm, I'm thinking about it, right? And I'm seeing these fish pretty far out. I, I almost wonder if it was this far out or not. Oh, okay. Hey, Mighty Magic Man. Not much, man. We're doing some fishing today. You're half asleep, so you get back soon? Okay, Yanni. No worries, man. Here comes another fish ninja leap. Ah. Interesting. Okay. So the island east of here, he says. Is he meaning this island, though? I mean, that's the thing. Is he meaning, like, east on the map? Like, this island? Or is he meaning, like, the actual cell to the east? This looks suspiciously like golf. And we know how much I hate golf. Ugh. All right, we're, 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 we'll, I'll play your game, you rogue. Come on. Well, for a moment, I thought we were going to be doing something, but oh, maybe it's maybe it really is golf. 
Maybe we get it in the hole and then we get to advance. What a horrible, horrible thought. Oh, Troll Tendo. Ah. Oh. Okay, yeah, Deku Leaf. Oh. I keep forgetting that this thing is super more useful in this game. Can we get them to come back? Oh, and they respawn. Oh, even better. After they pop, they respawn. And he tees up, and he froze up. Okay. Korok Leaf, got to use your putter. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, man. We got two in. That's got to count for something, right? I feel bad for only getting two in. We'll get that third one in, too, even though it doesn't do anything. All right. And he approaches the green. Oh. And he got in the rough. Okay. And now that I know what I'm doing, that's not too bad. You're slashing to the left, it seems. Yeah, that's uh, that's about my luck on Korok basketball also. Is Whoa. Oh, gosh. Now they're... Now it's all serious business. You can see the nut deteriorating once you pick it up. Yeah, I noticed that too, Matt. It looks like it takes a bit for it to kind of fall apart. Oh, wow. And because golf by itself isn't hard enough, let's introduce like other people trying to play on the course. All right. Fine. Fair enough. These blue chews. Now, my understanding is they're, they're supposed to be rare. So we'll... Really? It didn't... There it goes. Okay, I was about to say, wait a second. There's no physics, it looks like, built into... Golf. Mag promises a golf stream. And then he proceeds, or promises a fishing stream, proceeds to go golfing. This is definitely... Definitely the most white colored kind of stuff I've done in a while, guys. Can't even reach it. How long have I been streaming for? Ethrin, I've been streaming since the end of January, man. January 30th, of 2017 is when I channel, the channel opened. Uh, as far as how long I've been streaming for today, I always stream at 8 a.m. Hey, Therajate, how's it going, man? You just mastered the yo-yo. Oh, cool, Kristen. Means you can walk the dog, go around the world, and do all sorts of cool things, I would hope. No, still not getting the... And the thing is, right, is I only get like one or two shots at this. If I go further back, does it give me a... Oh, it does. Okay. But the Korok Gust won't reach to it. Okay. Hmm. Which game is this? This is Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Also known as Golf with Friends, Fishing with Friends, Boating with Friends, and um, 
Morning Korok coffee, more, more importantly. Man, I, I, I'm pretty sure I line up just straight and it booms. Hey, welcome back, Jaden. Welcome back. Try adjusting the wind. Oh, you know, I keep forgetting that that's a thing in this game. This is horrible, right? So, let's see here. Kind of would be better off if the wind were going east, maybe. Wind doesn't affect it? Okay, just get my angle right. All right. Um, oh, there it goes. There it goes. Even if the wind didn't affect it, the fact that I took a moment, stepped back, did something different, then came back to it, I think is part of what helped also. Oh, there's a hole over here, too. <laughs> I'm thinking it's going to be like some sort of guy looking over the edge of the world or something. Like, telling me, like, the world loops around or some jazz like that. But no, it's him just with the kaleidoscope. That's pretty funny. Boy, I really made that thing angry. All right, well, I don't know if we will get a opportunity to get this chest, like if it will despawn or something like that. So we'll get that there. Does affect it. It's just a minute difference. Well, a minute difference is all I needed. A treasure chart. Old man Ho Ho gives me clues? Okay. So the guy with the snack cakes is who I need to talk to. Oh, that wasn't good. Why didn't my leaf work? Because I'm out of magic power. Ugh. Oh. No bueno. Please don't tell me. Okay. You get a piece of heart from the hole. Well, pieces of hearts are good. I'm going to go there. Fidget spinnerfish. <laughs> Pretty much there, Jade. Pretty much, man. And we go down the hole. See what happens down the hole, guys. Let's pause for a second as I get a drink. That's a whole lot of angry down here with me and... Master Sword versus these dudes. And of course I forget to push the A button. You know, I, I feel really bad when I don't do the quick time events on this game. Because it's like, oh, by the way, congratulations. We're going to tell you when to parry. And you still can't parry, right, Mag? Ha ha. Sweet. Fire is effective against them. Okay. Uh, cup of the day. A balanced diet is a cake in each hand. Got to make sure that you don't overweigh one side or the other. I'm chill? Well, thanks, Mighty Magician. I, uh, I'm pretty laid back. I, I don't rattle easy. I have a very high-stress job. And, I mean, it's super high-stress job. How do you make Korok coffee? Well, Ethan, you take a Korok, you take some water, and then the Korok doesn't like what happens next. But, uh, 
But yeah, you take a lot of Korox, a lot of water, combine it, and you let it steep for about, I don't know, three or four months, and then you get the coffee. It's kind of what we're doing, you know. I mean, this game here is basically Korok coffee. I mean, here we go. We have all this water. I mean, all this water. And the Deku tree basically... Oh, really? Really? It reset the golf course. Uh, we still have no magic power. You know what we need to do is we need to go back and say hi to Grandma. We're close enough to Grandma we can go say hi and get some get some soup. Don't want to make Korok coffee with Hetsu's gift. I don't know, man. Uh, you know, people aren't really sure entirely what Hetsu's gift is. We presume it's part of the the Deku tree. Koroks love water until it's boiling. Yeah, I guess they're like frogs that way. Frogs will go in a pot. Actually, it's been disproven. Oh, Diego, no worries, man. No worries. What's a Korok in real life? Um, some sort of digital art in the Nintendo Labs, I'd guess. We got another fish square, like three, four squares away. Fish was talking about a Swordsman East outset island? I'm guessing so, Dogai, actually. Korok seeds plus water equals Korok coffee. That's that's kind of the recipe. Um, it's actually probably better tasting than it sounds. Like your Korok coffee with a pinch of magic? Well... I definitely like everything that I have with a pinch of magic, which is why we're going back to Outside Island for a second. Because we absolutely need to be coming over here and getting some magic. Orca of the Sword Tutorial, dude. That's what I was thinking, Matt. Uh, no, I need more um, Swordsman emblems. Right now, I... Oh, actually, no, I got ten. I think he wanted ten, didn't he? This will be a good place to refill our magic, too. Uh, yes, I can teleport with the Cyclone ability. That's right. I forgot about that. Yep, I got 10 night, cr night crests, so we should be good. You there. Uh, no thank you. We got something for you instead. Powerful sword technique. Ooh. Hmm. I have not talked to him since I got the Master Sword. I just got it from yesterday. Got some coffee and cookies from Starbucks. That's awesome. What's the point of this vid? Ethan, we're doing 100% unlock, man. Uh, we're doing fish today. But we're kind of, you know... Fish are like Korok seeds in a sense. And you know me, man. I'm, I'm Shiny Squirrel Syndrome, so... Okay. <laughs> that's that's pretty interesting. <laughs> Thanks, Fox. You learned the hurricane spin. So it's kinda like our boss's fury. Hey, Golden. Yeah, magic filled up on that. I'm, I'm happy with that. Saw Charles on another stream the other day. What are the chances? Well, pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, people that watch my content, people that watch other people's content. Yeah, Link is a fidget spinner. Yeah. It costs magic to use. Yes, I saw that. It makes me a little sad, but it is what it is. Hurricane Link. Yeah, Stephen Thompson, you're correct. I am, I guess you can say that Link is tops now, right? Let's see. Well, 
trying to think if there's any other kind of secrets on this island that we haven't gotten to yet. But I don't believe so. I mean, we've been in that forest. We found out how to get there. All that kind of stuff. We found the rock on the other side. Oh, there's Beetle. We might as well pop over to Beetle, maybe. Nope. No need to pop over to Beetle. You can double your magic meter if you want. Okay. Hmm. I don't know. I know how to get 100 rupees. I'll just go and cut this grass, man. So a way to double the magic meter. Is that is it nearby, Matt? There's a hidden chest. There's several hidden chests on this island. Uh, there's a good chance I might have gotten it. Maybe not, though. Think so? And so go east, I'm being told? So, Headstone Island? Oh, we gotta actually get the, uh... The power bracelet off of Fire Island, though. What's my objective? We're tracking down fish, Diego. Fish that we don't have unlocked yet. So I think we'll just double back for all that. Hey, opponents, how's it going? I think it'll help me much, much later in the game to have all these actual map quadrants marked. It's the middle bottom cell to find the squid double the magic power. Okay. That's probably the one that they keep talking about with the... Um, the, the moon. Oh, if I had to guess. Go two squares east of Outside Island and head to some circling seagulls. Oh, that's the circling seagulls you guys tried to get me to go after that last time anyways. Alright, it's on our way to our next fish spot, so we'll do that. And guys, don't forget to get your likes, shares, comments, subscribes, all that good hashtag smoke signals kind of buy a vowels in so you can get the stream to be just a little smidgen longer uh, at the end of the nine o'clock hour well at the top of the nine o'clock hour rather we take the likes the new subscribers we gained and the number of people watching and we stream for that many make sure you take a photo of the enemy there's only a limited amount okay well hopefully we'll get a, a good picture this time and not a horrible one Oh. Hey, that's a good photo. It says actually good there. So we're going to save that pictograph. We're going to move this bow over. I got a funny feeling that the bow is going to be needed to shoot his eyeballs out. I don't know about you guys, but I'd be pretty angry if some guy in green outfit and blonde hair just come over and shot my eyeballs. Is that a whirlpool? It's a giant whirlpool with a squid in the middle. Yeah, try not to repeat the I, I exactly, Matt. I'm right there with you, man. I'm right there with you. I I've, I felt so bummed yesterday, guys. Come on, squiddy. You're a bit sick. Oh, use anything that does damage. Okay, well, bow seems to be pretty good so far. My boomerang's better? Hmm. Well, it looks like the bow worked pretty good. Oh, how to be sponsored. Jaden, um, first question. Are you using an iPhone to watch the stream? Because if you're using an iPhone to watch the stream... You, unfortunately, won't be able to be a sponsor. You have to be on Android at the moment or on a computer. Did I like the Zelda cartoon? Yeah, I did. Hey, we freed a fairy. Yay. I want the boomerang for the squids. Well, that's good. You're on PC. Okay, well, on PC, if you're on YouTube... Toward the top of chat, you should see a green sponsor button. If you're on YouTube Gaming, toward the bottom of the chat, you should see a green sponsor button. 
Sponsorship does require a $5 commitment per month, though. That is good, guys. Thanks for that. That's going to help me. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Okay, guys. Um, that's the squid with the lowest number of eyes? Okay. So they all have, like, more and more eyes. Do they count as different squids is a good question, too. I mean, if they have a certain number of eyes, I mean... Is, uh... I mean... Uh... Hey, Roblox Gamer! Morning, Vulcan. How's it going? Okay, Mighty Magician. Magic Man, no worries. Mm -hmm. Ooh. wonder if I could use the... The fairy told you about the fire and ice arrows. Yes, it did. Here's a... Okay, so here's a cold island. There's a fish. I saw the fish. Just got to get out of the snow here. Doesn't look like I'm taking any damage. Oh, it was, Vulcan. It was. You can teleport to a cool island now. That's cool. I don't quite know how the teleporting works yet, but uh, I'm still kind of gathering the fish right now, so I don't think teleporting is really where we want to be with it. All right there, Jade. We'll be here, man. And boom! The bottom two rows are complete, guys. We're getting there. We are getting there. Treasure inside that freezing ring of ice over there. Okay. Four squares north and three squares west. All right, so I think that's where we head to next. I mean, I want to get that kind of cool awesome. Uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild help, please. Uh, Kristen, this is not the place to ask for it, really. Um, Discord's a real good place to ask for that. But in the middle of my Wind Waker streams, not so much. Um, going to head off for a bit. Okay, cool. See you, Lou. Uh, I, I would like to think I can get them. But if I can't, I can't. But I would think that they would tell me... Like, when I can and when I can't. We already got this particular place marked on the fish map, so we're good there. So this is one square north. Oh. Hello, squid. Um... Okay, so, so far, so kind of good. Sort of. You don't have Discord? I'm sorry, Kristen. We really want to keep the actual conversation in the chat to the conversation of the stream. Can we get sucked in that whirlpool? I don't know, Therajate. I really don't want to find out, though. That's why I'm trying to beat him down as fast as I can. And it did come out of nowhere. You're absolutely correct on that. I was I was boating around, minding my own business, like any other kind of aquatic motorist. And then this squid decided to come up and decided to spin around the water. I almost think that the bow would be better for, like, the last eyeball or something. I can. Well, that's good to know, Drew. That's really good to know. Now, do all the squids free fairies, or is it kind of random?
Well, that answers that question. Okay. Congratulations, Link. You have freed something. Okay, only one squid has a fairy? Okay. We'll, we'll cruise away for a second so we can get this thing to respawn. Ah, too many too many times hitting the stop button. Alright. Salvage. Go a little forward. Salvage. Missing it. There we go. We got whatever it was. Sweet. Oh, a bright orange rupee for 100 rupees. Okay, well, that's not too bad. Hopefully they're better than rupees for what we get, though. But you never know. And guys, there's the 15-minute warning. Make sure you go ahead and get your likes, shares, and comments and subscriptions in there. Um, that way we can kind of get the word out, get some people to kind of watch, and make the stream longer. That's the important part, right? Is It's not so much everything else, but just to get the stream to be a little bit longer so you guys can enjoy watching me wander around this aimless ocean. Yeah, the chest is bigger than Link. The chest is almost... Uh, I would say that the physics involved in the chest is a little iffy. Hey, it's a beetle. Let's see what he has to sell. I'm guessing nothing of importance, but we just got 100 rupees. What's well, the max amount of rupees you can get in this game? I don't know, J, but right now I can hold 1,000 the most. Hey, Turbo. Arrows, bombs, and a red potion. But we don't really have a need to get the red potion. I'll buy 30 arrows, max my arrows out. 19 points saved up. I think I can carry 60 bombs, so might as well just buy that to max up my bombs as well. Uh, Silver Rupee is 100 in Breath of the Wild. This one's orange. You are correct, oh guy. I'm guessing the color between orange and gold in Breath of the Wild would have been just too weird. Oh, Arx Quantum donating a dollar twenty. Thank you for that donation, sir. Really appreciate that, guys. Get a hashtag Arx Quantum going in the chat. And just a few moments here, we're going to do two things. One, Arx Quantum for being an actual donor gets his information put right into the chat description. And with that dollar twenty. He does become the new Free For All Friday winner. Now, keep it in mind, guys, this is going to be a two-week-long contest for Free For All Friday this time. And the reason behind that is because I have to work next Friday, which is kind of upsetting to me, but it is what it is. All right, RX Quantum, we got you there, man. Appreciate that donation, dude. That is super awesome. If you are a member of our Discord, uh, if you post the uh, Discord tag that you use in our YouTube chat, I'll make sure that I'll also get you a sponsor tag inside of Discord. Or a, yeah, the supporter tag, not sponsor tag. Google with your confusing terms that conflict with the already terms that I'm using. We really appreciate that, man. That's super awesome to be there, man. I see the fish off in the distance. Here 
we go. Whoop. Stop. Put on the brakes. And put out the food. Come on, fish. Come on. Did I get the cell? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Hey, fishy. How's it going? She shouldn't be that useful at all with all the water. Um, what would I do when I finish Wind Waker? Same thing we did when we finished Breath of the Wild. We'll leave it up to you guys. Discord tab is High Ruler seven nine zero six. Let's go over here. Okay, just a moment, guys. We'll of course be adding five minutes to today's stuff because we always always um all right so at one point once you are in our discord officially high ruler we'll be able to go ahead and give that to you oh uh, let's see here speaking of which we got another person in the discord today looks like a topher senior I think that's actually Kristen, because that's Topher that uses Kristen's account, if I remember right. Oh, we already know about the auction. Silly fish. Oh, thank you, Vulcan. I appreciate that. Hmm. Let's see here. Just a moment, guys. I'm checking one real quick thing here. RX Quantum, I think you're somebody that I already know, man. And if you are, um, I'm going to refund your money and I'm going to ban you from my Discord. Just letting you know right up. Um, but if you're not, then welcome to the community, man. But your uh, your Discord avatar gives you away. And we're still looking for fish, guys. Hopefully we'll find it. Um, there's a person using your avatar, RX Quantum, that's not a very friendly person. Um, they basically use really bad language, and they've been removed from several discords that I'm a part of. So I'm hoping you're not them trying to ruin my day-to-day, -day, man. Ooh, some bombs. You're not the guy that I think you are. Well, that's good to know, man. I'd hate to think you are. Because the guy that I'm thinking about is a racist and a bigot. I'd hate to think that you're one of those guys. And guys, don't forget, we got about another eight minutes to get your actual likes, shares, subscribes, and stuff into the chat. Into the Discord. Uh, not the Discord. The YouTube video today to see exactly how long the buffet will be today. All right. You literally just joined the Discord. Well, our Discord, yes, but you can make more than one Discord account. But no worries, dude. If you're not who you who I think you are, then we'll just drop it and we'll leave it at that. Jump, hard spin. Come on. I know there's some rupees over here. Somewhere over here should be a fish, and I still haven't seen the fish yet. I think they're actually intentionally... What is that? Oh, that's another seagull intentionally give me shiny objects to chase so I don't find the fish.
Hmm. Tricky fish here, guys. Tricky fish. Convinced that Seagull was racing you. It looked like it. Uh, we're trying to find all the fish, man. There, Jate. There's a total of so many fish on the island, and I'm trying to find them as we come across them. And there's supposed to be one per per map cell. And I'm not seeing the one in this map cell. He may be the trickiest yet. What did you miss that keeps you from 100%? David Trapman, we did not get a picture of the Cyclone God. Oh, there's the fish. We uh, we actually wound up shooting him with arrows before he actually <laughs> before I snapped a photo of him. My nephew who lives with you is a big fan of Zelda. Well, that's great, Vulcan. I love that. Items. Do, do, do. Get the bait going. Start slowing down for this fish. And then put the bait overboard. Hey, Stefan. How's it going, man? Hey, Zombie Billy, how's it going, man? Guys, we got five minutes until we check. Uh, if you're going to 100% the figurines, you can't do that on the first playthrough anyway. Oh. Really? Okay, well, that's good to know. I knew to, I do, too, know what Choo Choo is. <laughs> A monster like Puddles of Goo. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so it's like a Choo Choo Island. Hmm. Intriguing. Do I like A Link to the Past? Yes, it's in my top three. You could do it on the first playthrough? Okay. Confliction of information. That's the way it goes sometimes, guys. All right, let's spin Link the right direction. And let's go. Wait. This looks neat. What is this? Shiny object, guys. Squirrel. Salmon tuna. <laughs> yeah, it was zombie. It was, man. It was, it was a fun time, zombie Billy. Tristan Cryer. Hey, how's it going, guys? What is this? Okay, well, that's fun for those of us that didn't, like, get a map or something. Huh. It's like a paw print almost with the little three islands over there and the big one here. Odd. That treasure had a pillar of light, so that means it was a treasure chart. Okay. Um, that's another thing that I got to be more diligent about. All right. We'll actually probably save the charts for one day as well. You can't color photo the first boss in the first playthrough. Um, you can go back to the castle. Oh, the very first boss. Um, there's a little hole in that big boulder. Go inside the thing? Okay, we'll go back. We're, we're going back, guys. But you may experience it more than once. Try cutting the grass. Okay, oh, and now we get this huge pillar of light. All right, I see what Matt's talking about. I, I somehow missed that earlier. Cruise a little. Maybe not. Must ride the king of Hyrule. <laughs> I don't think he's the king of Hyrule, but he's the king of lions. The boss on the dragon roost is what you can't get in color. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't even have a pictograph for Dragon Roost, right? Or at least you couldn't on Wind Waker for GameCube. Well, that's a possibility also. Must ride the King of Hyrule. Do -do -do -do. All right. There we go. 
Boom! Piece of heart collected three so far. Okay. Well, that is super awesome. That was worth it. Now we just got to get back over here and go into this little hole you guys were talking about. Haha. <laughs> Blue's clothes, you find a paw print. Yeah. All right. So. Time to cut all the grass, guys. Oh, there's the hole. Okay. Sneaky, sneaky. Put it all away and crouch. Time to army crawl. Woohoo! You can't do it on the HD version. Oh! My goodness, RX Quantum donated another $1.20. Oh, way cool. Appreciate that, man. You guys, get another RX Quantum hashtag going in there. Put that up to 2.40. And it is 9 o'clock, guys. Which means we're going to take a real quick small break. Just to see how many people are watching. And that total is 38. Let's see the number of subs we gained today. We've gained zero subs, but that's the way it works sometimes. Let's, uh... Let's just be sure that we got zero cut subs. Let's go ahead and smack that sub counter a second. 2097. Yeah, it looks like it's still there. All right. And the last thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get the official likes straight off of the YouTube app. Waiting that for that to load. 37. So 39 and 37, guys. We're going to go ahead and make that... Um, an even 80 for math. So, uh, doing a lionel hunt. Okay, cool. So, even 80. So, we're going to go for an extra hour and 20 minutes today, guys. That means we're going to be streaming until 1020. Let me go ahead and set the alarm for 1020. And... Bam, guys. So, we are streaming it officially until 1020 today. GameCube version one like you can't get the color pixel box until after you beat Goma. Uh, okay. So that tells me that there's a Goma to fight. Now this is a conversation probably better saved for Discord. So it doesn't spoil it in the chat. Alright, so. Going to pop downstairs for a minute? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's true, Korok Lee. If we put it in our notebook and we think, think, think. Oh, thanks, Brandon. I really appreciate that. Unfortunately, we keep the the nine o'clock thing as a. I don't I don't like this, guys. This is this is looking. This is looking like something bad, huh? But welcome to the Turtle Club, Brendan. Appreciate that. All right, let's. Um, whoa. Lots of choo choos. Lots of choo choo jelly. Looks like these. Hmm. You're meant to come here very early, so it's not bad at all. Okay. Mag, you should play some Battlefield Heroes. Lucas, you know where the recommendations go, man. You love how kind of the boomerang is about the size of Link's torso. Yeah, everything that Toon Link uses is just giant and over comical value, I think. Oh, two year old watches Blues Clues a lot. That's pretty cool. Um, there's the, the guy who played the original character on Blue's Clues. He's got an actual comedy performance. It's, um, 
pretty unsettling, actually. I don't recommend finding it. I kind of like thinking of Steve as being Steve and not somebody horrible. Ah, oh, we got a bomb! Fire in the hole! I kind of feel like this being like the Choo Choo Cave is going to involve me eventually having like some giant chew I have to fight. It looks like there's a chest here, so maybe not. Oh, here we go. This is what we've been waiting for. Yeah. Wait, that wasn't as cool as I was hoping it was going to be. I expect it was going to mow them all down, but nope. Spiffy, super awesome pin ultimate attack that two ancient sword studiers come across. Steve is better than Joe. Uh, a lot of people say that. It's kind of like Diet Coke and Coke, or you know, New Coke and Original Coke, right? Wait, there's there's a wait. Hold the phone. Did I somehow? Oh, there's a glowing light. That's where I went to and blew up the rock. So there's another room over here. They may have flattened. Oh, yeah, oh, that's true. That's the defense mechanism that Choo Choo's have. Kind of walking around. All of a sudden, here they are. And boom. Flatten. And then up. <laughs> there's a secret part in this, too. Secrets upon secrets upon secrets. It's like we're playing Game of Thrones here, guys. What does FFA mean? Free for all. Free for all Friday. Oh, yeah. Thought he passed away the original Blues Clues guy? No, he, uh... Breakfast time, cool. No, he actually uh, did not um, want to be known as the children's TV show guy as he was going bald, and so he quit. How do you get the red cell? Um, this fast cell you got to get at the auction house in uh, Windfall Island. Okay. Well, I was told there there was Punch and Pie and Secrets. And so far we found Punch and Pie and no secrets. Except for a place to bomb. So, I have a funny feeling that these blue things have to be... Uh, almost, Kristen. No F. Uh, we're just going to use FFA from here on out because the day may change. Blue's Clues is on Amazon Video. Okay. Uh, you got that... Well, Mighty Magician, it happens. We unfortunately have to draw the line at 9 o'clock because that's when our streams usually end. But that's also one of the reasons why I round up. Uh, so we had 37 and 39. We rounded it up to 80. So we would have had 37 and 39 and 1, which still would have rounded it up to 80. So we try to account for people coming in right at the last moment. Two areas I have missed here. Oh, wow. I like the fact that there's two areas that I've missed here. Okay, so here is... We're going to have to re-examine it. So here's the room that we come in at. And we had to crawl. Okay, got to go back. All right, cool, man. Uh, Blue's room? Hmm. Yeah, spin-offs are generally not as successful. Oh, we got a hookshot post. We got a hookshot post. Let's uh, let's see what we can do with that. Nothing it looks. Um, unless oh oh dear goodness. Oh. Okay. Um. Okay, we'll 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 look for the. K 
can we get to that one from here? No, but we can get from that one from here. Oh, wow. Okay, we need to stop. Oh, wait, that's not the stop button. Uh, why does everyone call me Mag? Because my name's Mag Synchro. I am one half of Convertible Turtle Gaming. Digret's the other half. Press and hold ZR to climb up. Yeah. All right, come on. Up, up, up. Hey, Braden, how's it going, man? How many subs would have to come if the stream would go on for 24 hours? Well, 60 minutes in an hour, 24 hours in a day. So I would say that we would have to get enough subs to make 24 times 60. Was not a whoa. Come on, Link. Get your head in the game, buddy. Was not aware I could stand on the post like that. And... All right, so... Well, people say hello again. I say welcome back. That's kind of the way it works. Oh, there's a bomb hole there that we missed. Okay. Whole entire place of secrets, this one. Not too bad. Hey, Miracle Suzelda, how's it going? Joy pendant. Okay. How many of those have we got now? Because I know we need like 20, so we're three away. Oh, look at that determined face. Cool, something kind of good. How do you upgrade your magic supply? Uh, uh, UHC, man. There is a giant octopus at the bottom middle um, tile on the map. You kill that thing and it gives you twice the magic supply. Uh, yes, I did, though, guy. She now wants the 20. And I presume that's all there is to this island. What gaming system am I playing on? The Wii U, Master Nerd. I do have the GameCube, but I do not own this game on GameCube. The only place I've been able to find a decent copy at a fair price, it looked like they cleaned the backside of the disc with a Burlo pad, so I wasn't really wanting to put my money into um, a coaster. Oh, cool, Magic, magic Man. Well, have fun with Mario Maker. Mario Maker's pretty fun. And for those of you just joining in right now, my name is Mag Synchro. That's short for Magician Synchro. Uh, old, or actually Magician Synchronous, to be totally true. It's an old handle I had from way back in the 90s. I'm part of Convertible Turtle Gaming. That's myself and my wife, Dig Rat. You can do exclamation Dig Rat to hear more about her streams. I myself stream three different stream series right now. In the mornings, we stream what's called the Morning Korok Coffee, which you're watching today. Today happens to be a special buffet edition. After 9 o'clock, we count the subs that we've gained, the likes on the video, and the number of viewers, and extend the stream past the 9 o'clock by that many minutes. Fridays, we play the top donor's choice, which is last week uh, was Pizza Ball. He chose Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. We played a lot of games there. Uh, some of you may know me from that stream last night. And on Sundays, we do what's called Shipwreck Sunday. And that is something that allows our other sponsors and donors to kind of get in on the action. 
whatever the last digit for the current raised monthly money is at the end of Saturday's stream will determine what in fact we play on Sunday. Right now with it ending at the penny mark, uh, so that's a one cent. Uh, it's actually 41 cents, but one is the important digit. We'll be playing Mario Rabbids. So tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. until 11, we'll be doing some Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle. That is, of course, subject to change. We're streaming until 10.20 today. So any other donations between now and 10.20 or Super Chats between now and 10.20 can change that as well. Beware the night when the Crescent Moon base is up. That's all you can tell me. That's all the info he's got for me. Okay, ready to play. Um, sure, what's the game this time? Oh, is it more pin cushions? Okay. Oh, that was a heck of a leap he had. I don't think I was going to be able to predict that entirely. Uh, Mighty Magic Man, that's what I just explained about Shipwreck Sunday, man. That's telling you what each digit will actually change the game to for the last digit in the total donations. We're doing much better this time. I think I've only missed him once, maybe twice. You can shoot the frog in the tornado with arrows. Uh, we did that, Freddy. That's what caused us the problem yesterday. <laughs> it's been long since you played this. You can't remember what you win with that fish. Just rupees. Like 10 rupees per hit. And if you hit all t 10 of them, you get a double. Alrighty. So maps. Go this way. So we got one more fish to find over here. Oh, there's a beetle over there. Oh, uh, there's a lot of cool ones there. And again, it's all just dependent upon what people choose and have and donate on what. The, and again, it's for those people that are, you know, wanting to help contribute and want to help their. Hey, JSK TV, how's it going? Because, you know, it's not everybody has like $10 to donate, but they still want to give something to the channel. And I wanted to give them something back. And this is the way that I can let their donation influence the channel in a direct way. So I, uh, you know, that's that's the one thing. I appreciate the donations. I'm I'm always humbled when people donate money, but I always feel like I need to do something to earn that donation. There was a there was a fish over here. Oh, there he is. He's just really in the shallows. There's a beetle that sells more rare items, right? My understanding there is yes. Yeah, we'll probably chase down all the treasure maps in another stream, guys. I want to try to get the remaining fish done. I, I don't know if I'll be able to, though, because I also want to do something on this island here, because supposedly we're supposed to get some sort of fire and ice weapon here. Providing I'll listen to the other fish correctly. Huh. Visible treasure with light pillar. Yeah, I think you guys are getting some delay. I saw it as well. All right. Oh, wait a second. Hello there. Huh, it's a Goron. Hmm. 
Well, yes, we will. Because we absolutely have been trying to get rid of this flower. Pawn that off on him. Warp to this island that I'm on. Okay. Sure, I'll trade that for a sea flower. That's a deal. Meanwhile, he probably picked this flower off this island. That's cool. Dangerous times for Gorons. Oh, yeah, very much so. Oh, there's another... Hmm, okay. So, we need to... Do the Ballad of Gales. Oh, we gotta be in our boat on the ocean. Okay. To the boat. Oh, wait a second. Here's a blue chew. We are fighting some blue chews. We are fighting some blue chews. We are fighting some blue chews, because that's what we're going to do. The Silent Princess? A little bit, yeah. And hey, Shadow, how's it going, man? Glad to see you here today. And this is where we're at, so we'll just warp to Mother and Child Isles and see what happens. Boom! Is it Friday for me? No, it is Saturday for me, Mighty Magic Man. Okay, well, that's super unfortunate. Hey, Juliana, we uh, just got here to, th oh, this is not Fortnite, this is not Breath of the Wild. Here I am trying to, like, pluck the mushroom from the ground, guys. Huh. That's kind of uh, a huge letdown, actually. Should you play some Splatoon 2? Only if you want to, Magic Magic Man. Gotta do a lot of things, it would seem. Hmm. Well, I'm going to come out and... That looked like a Korok speed trial stump, guys. That's That's kind of frightening, too. Anything else of note here? I'm as part of the main quest. Okay. Good morning, Charles. It's going pretty good, man. We're uh, we're getting some good stuff going on. Um. Huh. I was. How did the Breath of the Wild Master Mode stream go? Oh, JSK TV. We got trounced. We we wound up going three hearts into Ganon. We were able to beat. Um, the first Ganon Blight, and then we lost. What does backseat game mean? Tell me what to do. Uh, that, that's pretty much what backseat gaming means. It means you don't have the controller, but you're going to act like you have the controller. It's kind of like backseat driving, you know, when somebody's in the backseat of the car and says, turn left here, turn right here. Uh, having fire, ice and fire break something this early? Um, possibly so. Possibly so. It just, I was hoping for it. It's simple to unlock the Queen of Fairies. Um, well, oh, we can only go to islands we have. Oh, we can go to some random spots. Interesting. Forest Haven, Southern Fairy Island, Outset Island, Windfall Island, Dragon Roost Island. Well, this is kind of where we were going for to try to get to the main quest island up there, but... Hmm. Well, let's go here for fish reasons.
Well, UHC, up until a few minutes ago, there's a good chance that I didn't even know that Zelda was in this game. So that's a huge spoiler. And we, we are, again, spoiler free. Do I have potato bots? Um, no, I've got night bot. I don't see a need for a potato bot. Gotta go? Okay, Lucas. Well, we'll be here, man, for about another hour. It's about 55 minutes away from the end of the stream today. Let's see what this beetle's selling. And beetle always looks just angry on the outside of his boat, doesn't he? Nothing good here. If you go to the island north of here, you get that special beetle. Okay. So that's where the special beetle is. All right. I'm looking for the fish here first, though. I don't know what Potato Bot is, but I know that I did research, and that bot seemed to be the best bot for what I wanted to do. And I'm actually programming my own bot, Clarence Bot, to do more important things, eventually. Now you're in a bad mood. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Demon Huntress. But the, the medical report today is not that bad, right? Breath of the Wild, he looks really sad with his flag thingy? Yeah. The many moods of Beetle. Angry, sad, moody. Huge eyebrows. Did I... There's the fish. There's the fish. Come on, fishy. Feed the fishy. Well, again, UHC, we didn't even realize she was in the game. So, kind of spoiler on story there. But agree to disagree, man. We'll both drop it and we'll both be better for it, I think. Hey, Orcat Zoe, how's it going? Oh, no worries, Demon Huntress, no worries. You know me, I, I've got a... I've got the... Uh, I got the memory of a 70-year-old and a 36-year-old's body, so there's a chance that I'll forget about that before it happens. So all these hints must be... Oh, uh, Mighty Magic Man. Nah, man. There, there's no reason to do that, dude. Those bots are just trying to cheap the... Uh, there's just trying to cheat the YouTube algorithm as all those bots do. I have no need to put one of those on my system. And hey, Mighty Magic Man, we don't advertise other streamers in our stream. Medical report's pretty there, yep. That's when it appears, oh no. Yeah, I'm guessing it is going to be another giant squid. And we'll be ready for a giant squid when they come. This island looks familiar. It's not good when these islands are starting to look the same, Nintendo. Come here, fish. Eat the bait. Before these big things try to eat me. Did I spell his name wrong? My bad. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's from a... I don't understand you're only joking, man. It's 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 the nickname that Digret gave me on our last stream. She said that Swag Synchro wasn't cool enough, so Nag Synchro had to be there. Yep, what Dylan's saying there. Rings of Light, yep, yep, yep. Treasure, yep, yep, yep. I love all the important information that the fish aren't giving me. Alright, see ya, Matt. Thanks for checking out for us. There are six islands that look like that from your boat on the map. They look like dice. 
Okay. Be back in like 20 minutes. All right, Magic Man. We'll see you, man. Orca and Zoe, we are hunting down the fish. We think that having all these islands marked on our map are going to help us in the long run for the exploration and the finding of certain things in this game. Especially when it comes to things like the treasure map that we have, the map pieces we get, all that kind of stuff. So we're going around feeding the fish, saying hi to them. It's kind of like Korok seed hunting, but not as uh, gruesome. Uh, we can't drop the rocks on the fish or anything. And occasionally we see shiny bits of stuff here. We'll have some Korok coffee right about now. I, uh, I'm getting a little low on mine, but there we go. We found it. Boom. The fact they're all shaped like dice is pretty cool. I bet there's some sort of, like, importance there. Oh, looked like there was either a, a swoosh of wind or a fish that jumped out of the water. Oh, small, teeny, tiny octopus. Fire! Shoot these guys. Figure out which button shoots and then bombs away. All these octopus trying to get at us. The fact that Octoroks are shooting bombs is pretty scary. You know, Nintendo, if you want to ever, like, revisit Breath of the Wild again, patch it to where Octoroks now shoot bombs and that'll... that'll make Master Mode even better, right guys? Octorots now shoot bombs instead of rocks. And they can no longer be parried. Um, don't know if this is actually going to be a, an end to the Octorocks or just the beginning. We start an Octorok war here, guys. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. I'm not sure entirely if they're Octorocks or if they're just squids. Yeah, we need to get out of here, guys. We're taking too much damage. All right. Uh, stop, stop. Take out the bombs. Um, we get our cell out and run away, run away, run away. He who fights and runs away lives to not have the death counter up go up by another one. All right, little fish, where you at? And we are still in... A unknown zone, so it'll help. There we go. Octonado, yeah, gotta go fast. Um, okay, I was pretty certain we fed that fish. Do we need, like, expensive fish chow? Yes, Cody, it is 100% just like Breath of the Wild. We will have to play the plus game to get the 100%, but we are doing the same thing. All right, here we go. Fish Ninja. Boom. By thief, but we did do okay. Mm. Hey, Eric! Uh, the game's map is nothing like Breath of the Wild's map. You are correct. Uh, this map is tiny, teeny, teeny, tiny compared to Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild's map was ginormous. I mean, that's the official measurement for it, guys, right? It's ginormous. I question that the brush they use doesn't leak considering they're in water. 
Um, well, special squid ink. Might explain why the squids are so angry in this game, too. All the fish are... Whoa. Is this another... Interable... Yep, it looks like it. Why well, I mean is that you have to spend money in this game, then it's free in Breath of the Wild? You don't have to spend money. Oh, interesting. Okay. Hello. Oops, wrong button. Oh, fine. I'll have at thee. Oh, wow. Another guard comes. Hey, I uh, don't mean to tell you this, but that guy dropped that. Looks like you dropped that one, too. And he dropped his. Hey, looks like we're going to get our 20 joy pendants. Oh, smack. Guy got brutal. Oh, there's the ladder, finally. Um, uh, yeah, kind of. It's like Korok hunting, though. Can we not even... Can we... Oh, even better. We just shocked the Snikes out of ourselves. Okay. It's a gold chew. It gives green choo choo jelly. Huh. Stand still. Thank you. And thank you for that, too. So there's enemies in each of these so far. This is true, opponents. Not dropping the windows when electrified is nice. But considering that the weapon system is totally overhauled, not surprising. I like the fact that I can lawnmower man those. Do I not like Z targeting? Um, depending upon the enemy I'm fighting, man. Some enemies require it, but I'd rather have the uh, the range of motion and the freedom. Oh wow! I like knocked myself loopy. Funny. It does increase the difficulty somewhat. Yeah, I, I, I think it does. But it's the same thing with Mega Man Legends. The Z-targeting system, I just didn't care for the uh, restriction it applied. Hey! Now we got another piece of heart. Sick Bay report. Link suffered a mild concussion from a big hit. Spinning making it worse. Also minor burns from electrocution. <laughs> oh, but yeah, Fox T, it, uh, it does make the game a little bit more difficult. Where did those enemies come from? Um, they were all inside chests. Where is that submarine? Uh, dead center in the map, actually. Kind of cool. I mean, like, the, the central tile in the map is where it's at. Random comment word of the day, Tattercell. Ha! Ah, that is a neat little word of the day. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Guys, we got about 
about 40 more minutes it looks like to get all the rest of the fish here and I'm, I'm i'm pretty confident we might be able to do it pretty confident we might be able to accomplish that today we won't have to worry about any more fish for the rest of the actual stream series I wonder if the uh, the map chart sticks around to the new game plus. Oh wow, so many submarines or ships or boats or stuff that we just don't want to mess with. Where's the fish? Come on, eat the food, man. Don't be afraid of the cannon fire. I'm not. Ha <laughs> ha, awesome. Boom. It's just got a little dot. Okay, well. What's it going to tell us here? The Golden Triumph Forks. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good question as well as what the definition is. I'm sure Demon Huntress is possibly typing it up or copying and pasting it. Or maybe wants us to further our knowledge by looking up the word ourselves. That sometimes happens, guys. A woolen fabric with a pattern of colored checks and intersecting lines resembling a tartan. Okay. Also, a pattern of squares formed by crossbars on solid color. That is pretty much the exact same definition twice. Told two different ways. That's weirder than a three-eyed billy goat in the back of a pickup truck in the middle of Manhattan. Is it really that weird, though, if you think about it? Manhattan's a very varied and... Uh, culturally meshed together place. I don't know if that would really be considered that weird in Manhattan or not. I've never been just, you know, kind of guessing. I've met several people from the Manhattan area and they're usually pretty uh, pretty well cultured. Hmm. There we go, here's another fish. And let's go ahead and feed this one. Boom. Awesome. It seems you missed a lot in your absence. Well, you're a little bit behind. No worries there. Wow, that's like some sort of super awesome fort kind of thing looking there. We definitely don't be fighting that at the moment. Do to do. Uh, Matt Rayford, yeah, he had to leave early. That's okay. No worries. Oh, that's kind of neat. Let's, um... Uh... Intriguing. Requires fire and ice, though, obviously. Which is kind of sad. Guess we gotta go back to Dragon Roost Island and get our... 
get our, our defeat from Ganon and then go back and stuff. Need a seagull. Yeah, seagull probably is going to be one of those things we'll need over there as well. But without the fire and ice, I don't think it's something that we'll be able to accomplish anyways. We got the pairs for the seagulls, but just... Uh, let's see. Let's see if we can find the fish over here anyways. The attack ship was gold? I must have missed that. Between looking down at this map and looking at chat, guys, there's there's a pretty good heavy amount of distraction here. Let's um, let's go ahead and see what we can find on this island, because it looks interesting. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Do, 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 do. All right. Of course, there's a Korok on the island. Couldn't you use the command melody for controlling a seagull? Uh, I don't know. And with the fact that pears are so cheap, I don't think there'd be a reason to try to try it on them. Okay. Um, I fought a, a giant octopus. Well, there you go, Jason. That's 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 a heck of a goal to have, man. 100% master mode is going to test you to your limits. I just tried to beat Ganon on it, you know, straight up, and it, it, was, it was rough. Hey, there's where the fish is. That's good to know. Oh, a blue chew. You always remember to take pics of the Koroks? Okay. I wasn't aware I needed to take pics of the Koroks, but I guess I can do that when I go to give them all water. Any boss, boss battles under the Octorok? Not that I remember. And now that I know I gotta take pictures of all the Octorok, or all the uh, bosses that I fight, uh, that's the only picture I remember wa taking. Um, there's a guy that needs it. Hmm. I don't have anything for delivery. Alright, so... The fish is... To the southeast, so we'll get back to our boat. And head to the southeast side over here. Yeah, a potion at the potion shop. It's the only thing I can know that the choo-choo jelly is used for. Fishy, fishy, fishy. There we go. Come on, eat the chow fish. You know you want to. Oi, small fry. Yep, that's what I am, is I'm small fry. Boom! I think we got more than half the map covered now, guys. What good little tidbit does he have for us here? Okay, hall's packed with treasure. Have a cannon yourself. There's no way to ever sink one of them. Yeah. Okay, so... Basically telling me I need to just blow up all the boats. I can I can do with that. Keep an eye out for that gold ship. Yeah, we'll we'll try to keep our eyes peered for it. 
Uh, it does, Eric. It, it makes it uh, less fiddly, I think, for the fast travel. Oh, there's stars in the sky. That's all those are. I was like, is that a fish jumping all that high? College professor who told they they could bring a five by. That's smart. If you don't use the actual measurements, if you if he says three by five, exactly, exactly. That's actually real smart. That's um, kind of like a a legal case that was actually in Oklahoma, where a, a man paid for his bill. Uh, for at the gas pump using like 16 bananas because it never actually had it marked as dollars yeah that's that's the way legal works I mean if you don't specify what you want 16 of then you wind up getting 16 of anything and it's considered a, a done deal so I always want to be really specific about what you're asking for when you want somebody to give you something Boyfriend is making Starbucks run. Oh, Demon Huntress. Awesome. To the next fish. There are cannons on the walls of these islands you can blow up. Ooh, that's good to know. We'll be blowing them up when we start going island by island for all their secrets. Right now, we're still just doing the fish hunt, guys. I think, realistically, we can get all the fish in the next 30 minutes, which is how long we have for the stream. So I think we're doing pretty good. But we're going to have to run by beetle before we do that, because we are out of bait almost. Oh, I saw this telltale splash of something. Starbucks disappoints you? Oh, Korok Leaf, why is that, man? Not a fan of Starbucks. Well, I'm not exactly like, I gotta get my Starbucks on, but 7-Eleven uh, had good pumpkin spice. Yes, they did. Uh, caramel one? Okay. I do, uh, I like their chai tea lattes really good. The last few cups you had taste like something you can make yourself. Oh, well, Cork Leaf, that's kind of true of Starbucks, though, if you think about it. If you've got the syrup and you got the actual coffee and the coffee caffeine is the world's crutch. Oh, Doug, I, I mean, if that's true, then I got some broken legs, man. I, uh, <laughs> I run off of caffeine. Oh, I got to talking and uh, didn't even see what he was saying. And watching the delay on the stream doesn't even help me, it looks like. Okay, there's just keep joy pendants. Okay. That's what it... Alright, the delay helped me just a little bit. Hey guys, by the way, Digrat's awake, and she says that she runs on caffeine and the tears of her enemies. So, just a, a little bit more than me. But uh, it helps when you got a lot of enemies, I guess. If you feed him, he'll tell you again. Okay, well, um, I've also got the ability to rewatch the stream after everything's all said and done, so I'm going to probably go through this stream and get all the little factoids organized. All said and done. Seen how crazy Starbucks customers can get with how much they spend on their iced coffee? Yeah, I, uh, I'm i not a crazy coffee order. I just order, you know, my chai tea latte and and whatever size contrivance that they use at the time. And then basically go about my business. Also tap the island map to see what he said. Oh, that'd be cool. You just passed a beetle. Um, that's good to know. I saw a fish, so I went for the fish first. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 more to go. 
personally just drink water. Well, water's good for you too. It definitely doesn't have any stimulant in it. Wonder how long it's been since the light in Windfall's lighthouse went dark. Yeah, we need some sort of fire to do that, I guess. Uh, yeah, there's a fish icon on the map. Okay. I, too, can tell the difference between convenience store coffee and barista coffee. One tastes worse than the other. Um, but they both taste bad, in my opinion, because I really don't like coffee. That's why I do the latte, though. Oh, okay, yeah, I can. Neat. Well, that's really good. That means I don't have to go back and watch the stream to get all the info. Uh, let's open up this beetle chart. There is a beetle somewhere around this area, guys. There's beetle. You there. With the boat, with the angry face. Oh, he's got all the shades drawn. This is not an angry beetle. That's This is like beetle trying to sleep during the day beetle or something. Oh, this must be the rare beetle. Okay. I'll buy an empty bottle. Oh, that's way too much. Um, no thanks, Beetle. Uh, no thanks on that either. Let's see here. Items? What can we sell to this guy? What do we really want to sell to him? Anything? I even forget what this is. Oh, that's the that's the tingle bottle. Okay. Well, let's just try to sell him chew jelly. See what he wants. He doesn't buy or trade. Oh wow. But. Oh well. Okay. Get sell Starbucks iced coffee six dollars a bottle, and then they buy four to five at the same time. Yeah, Starbucks coffee is good quality stuff. Yeah, need all that money. It's all about the dollar, dollar, dollar here, guys. Gonna have to get as many rupees as we can. And I can't play the post office game anymore, so that's kind of a a jip for me because I'm really good at the post office game. And that beetle was like the guy we were looking for. Oh, okay. We need to... We got to go to this other beetle to get our bait. At least he'll be around for seven more days, he said. I wonder if that's game days or real world days. That's a neat little fort looking thing. We'll have to go there after there. Yes, you can. The other guy is there. Uh, yep, it's marked. It auto marks it for me. Alright, here's Angry Beetle. Alright, Angry Beetle. Let's see here. How much do you buy Red Chew Jelly for? 10 rupees per blob. Yes, we'll, we'll sell that. 25. Bye. And then... Green Chew. And we'll... Oh, we can't go down. We have to actually go up. Alright, so... 36. That worked too. What about the special blue stuff? 15 per blob. Yeah, we'll sell all that too. Why not? Bye. And now we got enough to... Uh, let's, let's sell 
these as well. Try digging up some treasure from sea as well. Yeah, that's a good point. He'll only buy up to three seeds? Oh, wow. That's because I'm about to hit the max of my inventory. Okay. Yeah. We'd rather buy something. We, we need some bait. Got seven mad line. Oh, awesome, Freddy. Awesome, man. All right. Bye. Now we'll do this again. And I know I'm getting a little gypped, but I don't mind being gypped there. Partake in caffeine, plus it's chocolate. You love chocolate? Oh, yeah. Gonna raid the castle. Well, there you go, Freddy. That'll that'll help you replenish anything that you might be running out in stock for. All right. Everyone tolerates caffeine differently. That is correct. It's like any other substance that's foreign to the body. I know people that can't drink it. I know people that can't have it. I know people that actually wind up getting sleepy from it. No no high, just pure crash. Apparently that's uh, if your body metabolizes it too fast. Drinking too strong coffee too often? Uh, yeah, it can cause heartburn. Uh, it can also cause sleeping disorders. All right, come on, Magic Beetle. Where are you at? Oh, you get tired from me. Yeah, case in point, Drew. Case in point. Well, we know that Beetle's in this area somewhere. Open up the big, huge... Well, maybe not. There is a boat of some variety. Oh, there it is. There's the Magic Beetle. I love how he basically... Puts on the mask so he hides his identity. And then on top of that, he covers up the outside of the boat. It's like, I'm not Beetle, but I am Beetle. Alright, getting over here. Nine hundred and fifty. There we go. Boyfriend won't consume it too often. It gives him the shakes. Oh wow! Just like coffee, here's you tried coffee flavored jelly bean. Ah. Oh. There's these things in the United States they call the uh, buzz beans, and I will eat a lot of those. They're chocolate covered coffee beans. Um. Let's see here. This looks puzzling. Uh, with the uh, little beetle interlude we had, guys, I don't think we're going to get all the fish, so we're going to kind of go off the reservation a bit. And we're going to hopefully not increase the medical report. That was a hopeful that went away. There we go. One down. There's something down there. What's that? Oh, it's a heart in case we blow ourselves up. Okay. Blow it up from the boat. Oh. Well, that's smart. Welcome back, Lucas. But I gotta climb anyways to it, right? I presume that's the, the point of the puzzle. Oh. Concentrated coffee. That, that's, that's some pretty hardcore stuff you got there, Demon Huntress. Uh, what's the sign say? Okay, nothing really helpful. 
In the hole we go. Yep, you are absolutely correct. Whoa, it's super dark in here. Wow. Oh, here's the torches. Okay. It's like, where's our torch at? Da, da. Whoa, okay. There are a lot of angry bats, guys. Wow, we we're getting frame drops because of all these guys. That's that's insane. I can only imagine what this room like was like in the GameCube. And here comes a new chest. Uh, do you know how to read the new clock yet? Um, get closer, man. Getting closer. I do know it's like 10 oh something. <laughs> That's funny, Demon Huntress. That's funny. Get away, get away. Hmm. Well. Yeah, Eric Peterson, that's what I keep forgetting to do, man. Is taking photos of these enemies. I need to I need to get far better about it. Because it's basically the compendium all over again, right? Come on, look this way. Nope. No saving on the pictograph there. No saving there. All right, fine. You don't want to. You don't want to stand still for the photo. Stand still for the photo, man. I'm not getting a gold stamp on this one. Huh. Well, looks like uh, no gold stamp for chew jellies. We'll save it just in case. Maybe just maybe the uh, maybe the actual un other guys aren't more important enough for that. Okay, so we can either swim all the way there, or we can cork leaf there. So let's just cork leaf. Boom! All right, and we went so far underneath the water. Let's go to this last little island over here. Hopefully, we'll find us something. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Looking for the fishy. And equipping our stuff there. Korok Man has gone fishing, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. Nope, and yeah, now we got sharks. Oh, we got a flock of seagulls too. Let's go after the flock of seagulls. Here we go, guys. It's a squid! It's a giant squid! It's an angry giant squid. Do you have the Zelda edition Wii U? Uh, yeah, Lucas, this is the Wii U version. It's HD version. Squidward wants revenge. Hey guys, it's a Squidnado, right? That's what this thing on the ground is? 
The pain with the pictures is the enemy has to be face front and completely in shot. Yeah, that's what I'm gathering on it. It's definitely one of those technologies they improved in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> it's Angry Squidward. Yes. Is there a difference? Uh, there's a couple differences from what I've been told. Uh, the graphics improvement. Squidnado, yeah. We're getting awfully close to the squid. We're about to have to, like, oh, wait, maybe that beat him? Nope, okay. That's the last glowing eyeball, right? I think it is. We're getting too close. Getting too close. Oh, we couldn't beat him. In the squid we go, guys. Well, on the bright side, we didn't die. On the not so bright side, we got swallowed by a kraken. We got released by the kraken. That's a first, right? Usually you release the kraken, the kraken doesn't release you. So where are we now? Um, we are actually in the same square we was in. He didn't spit us up randomly anywhere else, so that's that's actually not as oh not as bad as it could have been. Need a pick of the shark. All right. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun 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 dun. dun. Oh. Wow. Try bombing next time. We might. Up. Oh. Looked like the shark was trying to chase after us, but then he wouldn't. Alright, there's got to be a better way to get a shark picture. Boy, it's like trying to get a photo of Bigfoot, apparently. Where you at, shark? Where are you at? There you are. I'm going to take that picture, but I don't think it's going to be any good. How long did the stream go today? We got about another eight minutes today, Charles. About another eight minutes. I am looking for revenge against the squid. 1020, you are correct, Drew Benson. You are correct. All right. Here we go, Squidward. You and me. Round two. Never tried bombs before? Yeah. Uh, played Galaxy Trucker. No, I haven't played Galaxy Trucker. So far, the aim on this thing is not as bad as the ring. Can I get the one on the back with the boomerang like that? Um, tell me he's dead. Tell me he's dead. No, he's not. Okay. 
There we go. Got him. Where does he keep his clarinet? I don't know. We didn't have a hand scope laser on bombs in GC version. Yeah. Uh, the scope's a little weird. It's a little weird. Ah, I was trying to stop the boat so I could salvage, and then I hit it too much to, uh, okay. Come on, boat. Stop on a dime. It's just a curious shark. There we go. That's the worst said in the game. Worst squid in the game, maybe? Autocorrect kind of making conversations fun. Oh, wow, it's a piece of heart, too. That's not bad. Okay, so... We're going to try to get a photo of this shark. Come on, Jaws. Where are you at? There we go. Wow. Wow. That was good. Now we can go back to trying to find the fish that's in this horrible place, apparently. Because somewhere amongst all these squids and these sharks is a fish that will tell us anything that we need to know about this area. Oh, very close to trying to get a photo of the, the Crimson Speedster. Yeah, right. You, oh, there's the fish, and he's nearby a, a piece of this island. Okay. Oh, that's some creepy-looking eyeballs floating around. Huh. And another Korok or something, maybe? Here, fish. Here's some chow. Wasn't it Scarlet Speedster? Uh, there's quite a few of them. Crimson, Scarlet. Uh-oh, this island. <laughs> that sounds like we need to be spending the next couple of minutes on this island. So we'll, we'll visit the island. Since we only got about four minutes left on the stream, we'll, uh, we'll visit this one. Oh! Awesome. Tingle! Not many fish left. No, there's, um... Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve fish. We did pretty good. Well, don't we have one of those statues in our, like, bag somewhere? I thought we did. Could have swore we picked one up. Like, the Tower of the Gods, we picked one up. I guess it didn't even go in my inventory anywhere. Weird. That is the statue. Oh, okay. Yay! I am still streaming Gleam Eyes. And yes, they are correct. There's only... Uh, wait, what? Oh, 
Oh, cool. Okay. A chart he hasn't seen yet. Guess we don't have any charts that Tingle wants. Hmm, okay. Uh, you get the chart later. Okay, that's good. Tingle statues weren't in grant. Uh, they teleport you? No, they don't teleport. Uh, Tingle Tuner. Yeah. Boom. Well, so that's kind of neat to see that we got these statues here. And let's see. Oh, oh. And guys, that will actually be the end of the stream. We will be saving here. Increase your fortune. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, this has been actually pretty fun. It's been great going around, kind of checking some stuff out, getting the fish done. Uh, yes, Eric, you are correct. There are four statues we need left to find. Um, but yeah, the buffet stream, guys, we were able to get a extra 80 minutes on it today, which got us all the way up to 1020, which is better than yesterday's buffet. So we're doing the improvement, which is always awesome. Uh, looking at the donation meter, we're still ending at the one cent instead of any other number. That means that tomorrow is Mario Rabbids. So for three hours, guys, 8 a.m. until 11 a.m., we're going to play Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle. It's been super awesome, guys. We'll see you tomorrow for Shipwreck Sunday. And don't forget, tomorrow evening, for those of the mature audience variety, we do have Sunday Night Skyrim with Dig Rat. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Take care. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Goodbye, guys.